latest edition in hashtag property ask echo today i am going to talk about a topic and a strategy that are dear to my heart a strategy that i still use and that enabled me to resign from my day job in five years the topic is how to find your first investment property obviously the first thing to do in finding your first investment property is to get out there into the real world and see what's on the market unfortunately due to the COVID-19 lockdown you will not be able to do this the good news is in South Africa majority of the real estate agencies have websites and there are other online platforms that you can use in order to practice this strategy that I'm about to teach for example you can also utilize the Begrand property website which is bigrand.co.za now grab a pen and paper and let's get down to business first locate areas that are within 30 minutes drive away from where you stay the reason is as a tycoon investor you need to have a hands-on approach and by having your property closer to you or around you will enable you to achieve this you then have to look at a hundred properties and this exercise will take a minimum a month assuming that you look at a minimum 25 properties per week you do not make an offer until you have looked at a hundred property the, there is an art and science behind this which I'm not going to go in detail here but can be discussed on another platform once you've looked at your 100 properties you will then take an average rental in a particular area we then now going to apply the favorite strategy that I'm speaking about which is the 80-20 strategy so after you've gotten an, an average rental income in the area that you've looked at you will then multiply by 80 to get a number so for example assuming that the average rental income you got is 10,000 rand you will then multiply 10,000 by 80 to get 800,000 that is the maximum price you need to pay for your investment property and you must remember as a tycoon investor your aim is to generate positive cash flow at least your aim is to break even also remember that as a serious property investor you invest with your mind and not with your heart for example assuming that you borrowed 800,000 rand from the bank to purchase your investment property that means that on average you'll be paying 8,000 rand on your monthly mortgage so all things being equal you will generate a positive cash flow of 2000 rand this is the strategy that i used to enable me to be where i am today and i hope that by you watching this video you'll be able to implement this strategy to enable you to achieve your own personal financial freedom should you wish to contact me directly my details are provided at the end of this presentation also please subscribe to my youtube channel hashtag property ask echo to get my weekly property insight stay safe stay conscious until next time bye bye